Technical top lane, and today that was, that was that was pretty nice. We're against a Nar. So the runes we're currently going to this mad lad are Gassion dying, Shield Bash, Bone, no, not Bone Plating, Second Wind, Overgrowth, and then we have Magical Forward plus Busy Delivery. And yes, I do have Doran Shield. It's a very good must-have buy. And so obviously Range Champions that will auto attack you or press Q, like Nar for example. And yeah, we're just gonna sustain up. That is gonna be the plan. So I do run Ignite into the Nar TP, TP, Nar lane as well, just because, well, Nar, while I guess he can be considered an aggressive matchup just because of the way he actually pressures you, he's not really a tank, he doesn't really build tank items, they go Stride Breaker into some other AD item, be it Black Cleaver or Sterix Gauge, I don't really remember, I don't play Nar as much as I used to, especially not this season, I like this, Rel currently moving, Grace that, oh, that would have been sick, Rel jumps over, did she steal it? No, she didn't smite it. He flashes over. Looks like he's gonna dash. Bro! Are you not as interested as I am, man? Come on! <laughs> Whatever. Um, Jin flashed. She ignited. Grace flashed over as well. So, two sums for one. Not really the best. But it is what it is. But yeah, with Ignite TP, you can actually obviously pick up quite a bit of kills on Nari. He's a very squishy champion when he's in mini form. When he's in mega, you never want to fight the guy. Has a ton of damage. So, really, there's literally no reason not to. Not to fight him. He also has quite a bit of CC as well, which is pretty hurtful. So we're just gonna chill. We're gonna collect this wave. Auto Q. I popped a potion. He's afraid all of a sudden. Understandable. Miss that. Auto this. Two. And I already missed that. So we're only done by two CS, which is actually pretty fair against a range matchup, right? You can max E if you want at the range matchups, but if you do miss your E, which against Nar is somewhat easy just because he does have an E key that makes him jump away. Uh, maxing E, if you happen to miss it, then you lose out on all the damage that you would have gotten and the attack speed. So essentially, it'd be like you just have zero points in the E just because you missed that set of ability. So, do it at your own leisure, whether you max it or not. Tag him with W. He walked forward that time. Quite a bit of damage on me. Mr. Udir. This would be very free if you'd like to run up. <laughs> Uh, first one down the mid lane. Love to see it. Love to see it. As I'm recording this, it is past midnight. So, I'm just going to be slightly chill. Tag him there. Ignite him early. Flashes that way. Interestingly enough. I mean, he's kind of just dead. <laughs> and I'm generally surprised he flashed that way. I tried predicting his flash, assuming he'd flash towards this way. You know, towards the turret where you could run away towards. He said no. He'd rather accept death and waste flash. <laughs> So I'll definitely take that. Um, yeah, I can't TP to you. Let's see, that's his TP. That's his flash too. If Udyr wants to come top, that he can very shortly. How's bot lane doing? Oh my god. Varus flash, I think. Uh, Sheen longsword. If you don't know what you generally want to buy, ask Kimo, be it whichever mythic item you want. Uh, TPing in here. Velkaz has ghost. Okay. <laughs> All right. I didn't know we had ghosts to begin with, <laughs> despite me tabbing and pressing various flash. To be fair, I thought I was cleansed, because, like, you know, normally a support wouldn't have ghosts, but yeah, he has ghosts. So I guess on my way top lane, you know, just chunk the guy for half his HP. Oh, if he hit that, I think he might have been able to kill. And then this guy literally went the half HP himself for absolutely no reason. I literally gave this man the best gank ever. But whatever. I, he, he fucked it up himself, I guess. I mean, he can still kill him. Nope, that wasn't even close, my friend. I sadly to say that... Ooh. Not bad. <laughs> Very coincidental timing. I like this. Yeah, that was... I, I don't know what happened to him. I gave him a great gank and he just botched it <laughs> for some reason. This guy's over here. Dropped the ward in the center of the lane. How's Nar doing? Slow pushing the wave towards me. Level 6. I'm nowhere near 6, by the way. Um, Holds me that way. Really good gank on... Amazing job. He's actually a very good NAR player. I will say that. Not many NARs would have just jumped on me right there. And this guy, he actually did really good stuff. I literally saw he was coming. Cause I'm like, all right, I should E away. But then by the time he stunned me, as he was throwing a stun down, I didn't want him to CC cancel my E. So I just simply let him waste ult the way he did. So that works out for me. Ouch. I'm with you, buddy. I mean, I can't die here. I'm not going to waste my ult either because he just wasted hop. See you later, buddy. 
Nice try though. Minions, please stop that. I appreciate it. And now we're gonna shove this out. So you know, ooh dear. He is ganking the only lane. He can actually make ganks happen off, which is actually pretty cool. Rush Ninja Tabby. Bot lane. Did you guys get a Ooh, Graves? I'm with you here. I actually do this like being well, I guess he has it on his own. Bear man stopping him down. Good job, man. We're gonna reset. Alright, well he doesn't need me. Pretty cool stuff. We're gonna reset ourselves, pick up Hearthbound Axe, and make our pretty ass back to top lane. Oh, she's looking for it. Flashes, knocks him up. Jin following up with a W, looking pretty good. Rel with the CC chain combo Q, destroyed the armor, heal coming through. Not gonna be enough. Fourth shot, picks up the kill on Varus. Good job, Mr. Jin. Looking pretty good. Rush Swifty Boots and Longsword, he's still out DPSing. The Noon Quiver Varus. Good stuff. And because we do have... Oh, by the way. Uh, Mr. Uter can come back top lane. I do have Ignite up as well. I ignited the, about the same time this guy ignited. I mean, T flashed. Sorry, flashed. Though I'm not entirely sure when he actually flashed. Because I'm assuming my Ignite just came up. So basically, two minutes until his flash comes up. But I kind of want to doubt it just a little bit. Q2. He's running towards him. Press that. How's it going, buddy? There's my boy Udyr. See you later. <laughs> ah, the best gank setups. That's how it is. Just curious, Varus. How long were you CC'd for? Honestly, if I was Varus, I'd be too tilted to actually check. Because being Premacy C didn't check. Yeah, he didn't check. I wouldn't have either. I would have been upset. I would have been looking at the shop just thinking about what I should buy next. Instead of thinking of how I just simply couldn't move that entire time. Anyways. This guy's doing his thing, auto Q2, 44 CS to 56, makes sense, we had Udyr do what? He pretty much, you know, taxed me, which is honestly perfectly fine considering he is ganking me, he's making lane a lot easier, that's one. Two, so, it allows him to actually stay up ahead on Graves, he's getting CS and XP. And three, it allows me to shove waves out, for example, crash under his turret, push it back towards me. That way, Nar is overextended again, and what can happen? My boy can easily just gank me again now, right? Just because, what? Look at this dude, it's right here. Literally right here. Well, I don't think he's gonna run. Ooh, does he have flash? He does have flash. He might be able to pick up the kill over here. He's running as fast as he can. He can't do anything more than that. And he's gonna take the cannon with. Makes sense. Smart man. Getting harassed by triple longsword Graves. I don't think Graves know that he's not gonna die for free. Yeah. And he's still trying though. That's for sure. Whatever. He'll just get XP then instead of gold. He's still a level ahead. He has tab. He has a lot of gold to spend too. By the way, he's been sitting on that for a while. QW. I'm gonna eat away. He's turning Mega. I'm okay with him trading with me there. Yeah, I take quite a bit of damage, but I oomph him. So uh, I force him to get Mega because he is auto attacking me. And generally, when Nar's a bottom Mega, you don't want to fight him. You won't be able to kill him before he can Mega, unless he's obviously really low HP. All that beautiful stuff. So we're just chilling. Woo! Woo! Fancy feet over here, am I right, guys? How's it going? He's ganking bot lane. Love to see it. We're four manning. Auto Q, Twist of Fate with the ulti, looking for it. Nar should have TP. Uh, Rel goes down a little bit early before the fight happens. It looks like Nar did indeed TP, or that is Graves. I can't see yet. I'm too busy focusing farm. Let's see. He doesn't die. Unfortunately, gets gold carded. Velkos ulted and Graves ulted. Yeah, very bad stuff. I think Rel might have went a little too early. And so it just kind of fell apart there. Because, yeah, she didn't use ultimate. She just straight up died. Pretty unfortunate. And Nar didn't TP, by the way, so I guess he just wasn't around. Or I guess he just doesn't have TP. I TP, did he TP? Yeah, he TP'd topside. And TP'd really early, so his TP's a longer CD. Tag him there. Pop bow plating. Udyr wants to use her topside. I'm with you, buddy. I do have ulti. We have Ignite coming up in 17 seconds, so we can dive the guy. Very easily. Well, comment down with your damage, dude. Auto Q2. I'm okay with that. I took him to half his HP. He's going to turn Mega here, but that's perfectly fine. We can still dive him. Uyr tanks first. It should be a free kill. There's his Mega. We're going to sit here. I do have Trinity Force on my back, which I honestly rather get. But it is what it is. If he just recalls, he recalls. I can't E into him the way I want to. Just because he'll just ult me mid-E and I'll just straight up die under turret with Chain CC. So it's not really worth it. Especially considering Uyr won't be tanking either. Regardless, though, we will pick up first turret here, which is pretty good stuff. As it go, Mr. Udir. Yes, slap it up real quick. Now slap this up. Nice. Rao topside, by the way. Man, I have a really good team, dude. It's fantastic. 
an Uder that knows he should be playing off Camille. A Rao who sits around top lane. Not gonna land that one, sweetie. Uh, we're not gonna go for a dive, though. We can get this... I mean, we can dive, but yeah, that's what I thought. Graves is around. This guy doesn't have ult. He did use a bot lane, but that's besides the point. I wanna reset. Spam ping and have this up. Nuisance. I did not know that was worded. <laughs> Alright, I'll drop a regular word here, I guess. I'll move a little bit more into the river before it. In case Nar just randomly decides to walk up, throw his dainty little boomerang at me. But we are going to reset, pick this up. Do I have enough go for Tabby as well? Yes, I do. And it's going to be definitely the boot item of choice. Auto attack base champion here. Another one over here. Another one over here. He autos every now and then, so that way he can get his third passive. So I guess we'll reduce his damage too. Silas, please, baby. You're what it for! Stop trying to make plays on your own, it's not needed! Silas, we got this. Just farm. All he needs to do is farm and not try to make solo plays. He got caught, I don't know doing what. Maybe getting vision for Graves or something, or my Uder to spot Graves out. Something of the sorts, but yeah. Yeah, man. I got flashed on. Well, yeah, but why are you over here? Instead of under your turret? Hey, <laughs> you know? You got flashed on because you were mispositioned, my good friend. If you weren't mispositioned, you wouldn't have gone flashed on, my good friend. Uh, not sure where this guy is. He's just farming it out. Silas or Twisted Fate. I like it. It looks like he wants to go in. Rel, jump in there. She's 2 HP TPing in. Really good knockup, by the way. Canceling that up. Nars TPing as well just to die. Taking this guy up. Pressing R over here because they should finish that guy off. Yup. Auto Q2. Nice! Beautiful stuff right there. And just like that, we basically ace the enemy team. Looking good. And we're going to go for as much plating as we can over here. Because, well, plating going to fall off in 18 seconds. Best I help them. Even though that plating does uh, increase more armor than what we were around, we're still going to get as much as we can. Honestly, we could probably get the turret too. Oh, they left me. Okay. Nice. Sounds good. I guess that allows me to get this on my own, which is not on my own. They leached me still. <laughs> but it's a lot faster. I might honestly... Nah, I can't get this turn in time. Their ball would be here before that. So I'll just shove the wave out and reset. Dude, whoa! Comment down there, Mr. Mathematician. That actually would have hit me if I kept farming. So good thing I didn't. Udyr's around... That ward just died... I'm gonna move a little bit more, just because I am a little bit afraid and we are gonna reset so i think I, we think i first start off which is pretty cool bot lane's close i'm pretty sure by bot lane's honestly gonna lose this turret because i don't think they've been doing much in the terms of defending on their own even though our Jin is fed they're still getting poked out by velkos because i guess he's just landing every single q because this guy's immaculate at his skill shots oh turbo camp tank gets it with the slow silas with the everfrost landing it that's gonna be a one shot they're looking for the various right now hits the empowered q not gonna be enough to stun return ulti and lives with one hp literally a slither of health and he's running away from minions nice i'm with you over here if i can get there ignited nice <laughs> Woo! got you buddy he actually almost got one shot i did not expect that twisted fate does damage dude so we should be able to get bot turret. We're gonna get... Never mind, we won't get bot turret. But... Ah, uh, can we dive? No, he has shield though. But we do get bot turret for sure. I was gonna say we might also get mid, but definitely... Actually, yeah, we can now. We can dive him since Rao's here, so he's not gonna be around. We're looking pretty good. We can look for the guy over here. Rao's gonna be moving shortly, maybe. That's a Q we're not gonna get hit by. She's gonna hit by the full combo. Q2, we're running towards you here. Jade with the ulti. Hit another one. Nice, free kill. Good stuff. Very good stuff. Twisted Fate ulti. Uh, we're with you over here. I gotta move a Valkos. Auto Q2. Literally one elf. W heal. Oh, so unfortunate. Don't die. He's dying. That's so sad. Wait. Oh, Rel? That's really unfortunate. This man had every summon, every summon as well in the history book, dude. That's kind of upsetting. Whatever. Oh, that's my bad. I didn't expect it. I should have. And the thing is, he also lived with 1 HP from my Q2, which is also really unfortunate. Because that made me take a lot more damage from his ultimate than I needed to. But it's whatever. Just come Drake next time. Yeah, might be. Well had. Thumbs up. Definitely my bad. Uh, Varus definitely just got a bunch of shutdowns, but he doesn't have a team that can peel him that well. 
So you should be okay. Good job. Um, you're an animal? <laughs> I I don't know. He could have eat away, but he eat forward for some. I I don't. Yeah, he's not trying. <laughs> I just, I don't think he's trying that much. He eat at them instead of away from them. I guess he really thought he could one v two for some reason. I don't know. Anyways, um, yeah. Ooh, interesting. Like I'm literally gonna one shot him any chance I can get, so it shouldn't be that much of a problem. I will be going GA third item, by the way, instead of Steric's Gauge, just because they have a lot of damage on their team. Steric's Gauge is way too much gold for me to actually get and finish in time, whereas I can just e easily get an early stopwatch and a GA. Um, I wish he didn't mark me. If he saw you marking me, then he knows I'm over here. Oh, he's over here? Oh, wow. All right, we got a splash. I mean, that was terrible by me. I didn't mean to E the way I did. I kind of eat a little more horizontally than I wanted to. Really unfortunate. Wanted to hit him with that W and the uh, stun. It's fine, though. We got the guy's flash, though. His flash will be coming up at 2239. I'm going to type that in chat. TFF 2239. It's been a while since I've actually... What's the word? Put timers on summoner spells in chat. And it's definitely a very good thing to do. You have Mega. I am not going to worry about you, buddy. <laughs> You're way too close for comfort. Wait, they got both Drakes? They got Infernal? Ooh. That's sad. <laughs> Oops. Hey, Rel. How's it going? But he will face check, though, right? I don't know why you dropped that ward. Whatever. Yeah, see, so he was literally sitting in that bush. And then because he dropped said ward, they know, which is really unfortunate. Sad, sad, sad. This guy's a 200 gold shutdown. I would love to jump on them. There's Graves. I'm not going to commit just because Velkos and the other one's there. Wait, Velkos wasn't there. I could have committed. There's his ulti. Nice. Free low. We take that. <laughs> Literally free ulti. We got Velkos goes too. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, I definitely should be going topside though. I'm still moving over here. I just got to get this ASAP. Once I can start split pushing and shoving waves as hard as I can, we're going to be in a very good spot. Um, he needs to not die here. I presume Nar is nowhere near Mega. It's what I would presume. My enemy don't top I need to shove this out. Very important I get this as soon as I can. Huge power spike, especially considering I am lacking in XP and gold. Just because Nar is up by 33 CS. That's actually pretty bad. Hmm. I'm trying to think. Yeah, I guess I am our. I guess I'm not our only best chance at killing Nar. We just don't have a tank shredder. That's literally the only issue. Tell me to be careful. I got you, buddy. Auto Q. We're going to go sword, door and shield, pick up Ravenous Hydra now. And then we're going to look for a TP play somewhere on the map. We have to make a pick before Drake. I don't think we want a 5v5. Our 5v5 is good, but getting on top of them is another issue. I. It's going to be very hard for me, too. That's just the thing. I mean, if Rao goes first and she just absolutely tanks everything, amazing. But I'm pretty sure Nar is going to be smart enough just to save his R for me. Or his W, or Velkos to save his E for me, etc, etc. So the issue. There's the ulti. TPing in. Uh, this guy's just not that good. He puts himself in precarious situations. You're right here, though. Oh, no, 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 you're in a bad spot. <laughs> Alright, we're doing this, I guess. That's so unfortunate. Yeah, I really wish he didn't go in. I only commit at that point because he went in, so he's going to die. So maybe we could pick up Twisted Fate, but no stop, which is amazing. This man needs to not split versus Twisted Fate. It's just really that apparent and easy. We're going to lose another Drake because of this. Mm. Only me splits, please. <laughs> this man's splitting and just getting caught 24-7. He lives, thank God. Never mind, he flashes way too late. That's really unfortunate. This man has 7 deaths. I mean, to be fair, he had 4 deaths in laning phase, which he didn't need at all, but... He's 7 now. You think you think people would learn that they shouldn't do something if they die the same way 2 to 3 times. And this man has died 2 to 3 times being overextended. Can we not... Get caught before Jectus? Yeah, that's ideal. He shouldn't have ulti. But he has Cloud Drake, so maybe he has ulti. But he shouldn't have ulti, which is the thing.
Oh, see you later, buddy. <laughs> Just like that. Good night, 50 shutdown. Now we can look for uh, Baron over here. Hey, Silas, buddy. I know you, you're you egoing right now, but uh, we need you over here, please. Your cannon minion. Eh, I guess the cannon minion does matter. All right, he's moving now. Nice. Uh, uses Herald mid lane. Ro is doing her thing. Like, we shouldn't lose this because, you know, it's 5v4. Uh, I didn't dodge the card, but he should still die. Good job, Jin. I appreciate you. Q. He flashes over. Take it. Please finish off, guys. Nice. Every single one of their mom has flashed. He's go. Nice. Good job. Smite. Stun. It's gonna be a kill. Jin, you grenaded instead of autoing for some reason? That's so sad. Rel, good ignite, but she dies at the end. You lose that. And our boy Silas is nowhere to be found. I don't even think he one shots. Oh, never mind. Oh my. I'm sorry for judging you, man. That was nasty. <laughs> Holy shit, RNG chains. I don't even know what he's talking about. Dude, he literally promised he see that Narda hell. Holy shit, that was amazing. Yeah, I am right though. I do want Garden Angel. I did get ignited though, by the way. Uh, I can't check now. Pretty sure I did get ignited, which really sucks though. Literally just roll the dice on that aim. What do you mean, of Jin W? Um, oh, he's looking to get sniped. Um, I'm looking to kill the guy. Just wait for me. Nice! Good job! And we're still- he smited early. Ooh. I mean, I guess he needed to smite for HP. But we should be able to finish before Graves gets here. This is what I want to say. If Graves hits it with an ultimate, I'm going to be very sad. Alright, nice. Yep, that's you both on top side. Alright, so a fiesta that went in our favor. I did end up dying, but we do end up... I didn't even know if I got assists for that, to be fair. I do have two assists, but I don't know if it was for those two kills over here. Just because it took way too long to kill them. And I don't know if he was actually in combat by the end of that. Oh, don't worry. I am not as stupid as Silas. I only die for team plays, not solo plays. Generally. We'll drop that word over here. Nar is currently doing wolves right now. Level difference. About the same. Hey, buddy. See you later, buddy. I... Twisted Fate might look for me. I don't... He does have Cloud Drake, so I'm not sure when his ult be up. But please don't die. It would be very stupid if you died. Okay, good job. Auto Q2. Drop W. Auto Q. Q again. And their entire team is bot side right now, so I want to be careful. I need four people here. I don't know why we don't even have four people here to begin with. So please start moving. You right here? No one's with me. I must make the play on my own. Hard to dodge that. See you later, buddy. We're dodging gold cards left and right. And, ooh, good pick over here. Yeah, four people bot side. Scary stuff, but alas, we do survive. I would love... Please, Mr. Udir. Oh, you're such a babe. No, 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 no. I'm half HP. <laughs> Man, <laughs> I'm happy he's feeding this man wants a red buff when he already had when he's literally already sitting on a red buff. Assholes, that's what they are. <laughs> uh, I hate people. They don't use their brain, sadly. Just not hard enough, anyways. Uh, looks like a boy's dying topside. Auto Q2 does do a Nars ultimate Kazanya's does stun him, but he is gonna go down. Getting caught splitting once again. You think they learn, but they just don't. Okay. I might be dead here. Oh, wait. What happened to his ulti? Oh, I think Jin W'd him. What a babe. Good job, man. Let's start moving now. And do we have GA on our recall? Yes, we do. And I'm going to resolve the safe space. Mm, should be good here. The only issue is that I have yet to use Zanya's. And generally, before you do buy GA, you want to use Zanya's. Because or else, if you do want to use Stopwatch, you have to rebuy it. So, that is the only thing that's unfortunate about it. But, at this point, it's just better I do have Stopwatch and whatnot. I mean, it's better I have GA and whatnot. Varus Velkos flash up. Yes, yes, yes. Just shove mid out, please. Force him to walk outside of the jungle. Mm, Graves over here. There's Varus. I'm kind of here. Oh, I'm also here, too. Okay, don't chase. I'm kind of on Varus over here. He's passing the safe way. I'm gonna see if I can pick him. Hard to dodge that. See you later, buddy. Got Varus because they don't have their DPS. Our team's winning the fight. Looking good. I'm on here, guys. 
I'm spamming Q2, I'm chain CC'd, I can finally move. How's it going, buddy? Oh, hey! Jin! Hit your shots, man! I'm gonna die because this man can't aim. Man. <laughs> I wish you hit a single one of your abilities so he couldn't walk up. That would have been perfect. Wait, Udyr was alive? You need to help me? What a nice guy. What a nice guy. Whatever, we have this now. Really sucks. He has Lich Bane? Yeah, he does. I was wondering why his gold card did 500 damage. But yeah, he fucked me. I can't lie. I mean, to be fair, there wasn't much I could really do. <laughs> My Jin missed everything. He kind of vented me. He griefed me. I wish he just walked up and autoed instead. Whatever, we finally got our first Mountain Drake. I did pick this guy up, which is pretty cool. He has no heal. I don't think he flashed. Full attack speed. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Now, to be fair, if I was him, I would have gone Krakus there. Well, actually, no, never mind. Two tanks. I guess, like, Bruiser can too. I guess Krakus there is perfectly fine. Never mind at all. So, we are going to buy this. We're going to start moving. All right. Let's see. Uh, Do I start splitting bot lane? I guess I do because I do have TP up. If I happen to find Varus, that'd be great. Really good stuff that I actually caught him over here, though. Actually beautiful. Um, Hopefully, they don't get caught themselves. And GA... Respawning in four more minutes. So if we can stall out till then, that's beautiful. But if not, it's perfectly fine. We still have a stopwatch. And we'll just keep doing our thing. Um, I gotta pay attention to TP. There's no Iron Mega. I gotta be careful. Is very so low? It's looking like it. I mean, uh, assuming if he is bot lane, then he is alone. Otherwise, he's sitting mid in fog of war or something. Uh, we're gonna move over here. There should be a ward here. That I've never cleared. There's various middle, which is to fate and Velkaz. I can't push for this just because they can rotate on me. Silas pushing top side out. Do we need to move over here? Nar. 2400 health. I mean, I win. It's just that he's going to be halfway to Mega under turret. If anything, he'll actually hit Mega before he even comes out of that. Yeah, very close. I can't fight him. I don't know if this is warded. That shouldn't be stupid. All right, they're sending, they have two people top side. Is this warded? Ooh, it's not. Very nice. Not gonna TP just because Nar will follow up with his own TP. I really gotta find Nar here, but after he finishes Mega Ing. So now we just simply wait. He doesn't believe in farming? Alright, awesome. <laughs> I guess I'll walk up myself. Oh no, there you are. Bro, how do you maintain Mega for that long? What? I mean, he didn't maintain Mega, but he was at 70 the entire time. Ooh. Twisted Fade ulti. Controlled over here, he just did that. I'm right, gonna walk back over here, pick this up. You gotta be careful about getting caught over here. Mm, let's go bot side. Chill, my friend. <laughs> He's just having fun with them. I'm gonna drop this over here. Pushing bot side, I have TP. I can solo Nar for sure. It's just literally... If he hits Mega mid-fight, I won't lose it 100%, but it does become problematic, which is the issue. And if I can avoid fighting him in Mega, then I just simply should. Um, I don't think... I gotta be careful. I can't just TP in because I'll just die. Now I can TP here because they're focusing. Nice roll, T. Man. Huh? Faker? He right clicked me? Yo, let's me splits and bring Nar in 1v1, please. <laughs> That's really all I need. Let's engage. Ever, if I'm splitting, please. Oh boy. That's really unfortunate. There's no there's no world we should ever be getting aced for absolutely free. Just cause my they wanna make a silly pick on graves when their entire team is obviously top sec is Baron's up. That's really unfortunate. And now I don't have TP, so I have to be with my team instead of splitting and bringing Nar towards me. Which sucks a lot of dick. Like, very unfortunate, but there's not much I can really do about it. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Play for Drake. I have F for next fight. Well, I don't think you not having Flash was the problem. That that fight, my good sir. All I could do was R there. I mean, that wasn't the issue. It's making plays without me. Chop W. There's Nar. Mr. Tank. Thormo, Stridebreaker, and Force of Nature. Drop Q. 
There's Nar. Silas, don't jump on him. Appreciate that. Look at everyone straight over here. They have to run to me. Well, actually, I can't just run straight over there just because of Soul. They'll go for Soul and definitely trade up Inhibitor any day of the week. I also have GA up, which is also really cool, too. I gotta walk around here. No, no, no. Walk over here, Rel. I don't need you with me. Yo, guys. Rel, you wanna go in? I can't move. <laughs> nice. Eating away on the Twisted Fate. Or Graves, I guess. Q2. Nice. I couldn't press stop one time. 2 HP over here. Nice. Good snipe. That's Yo, we just end. We just end. Who's alive? Velcos and Twisted Fate. I have stopwatch. We can just go for the dive having night too. I hope we can end here. I for sure do. If we can't, I'll be very sad. Velkos has no uh, stopwatch. Uh, Silas or Jin hits a W or snare. It should be free, hopefully. Well, don't get hit by everything, dude. That's also very important. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we can't do it. They're sitting at max range. Jin was full HP. He's now 2 HP, which is really unfortunate. Alright, well, we got three of them. Rel dies. My GA is down again, but I actually still have stopwatch, which is pretty cool. Uh, we'll just take resources away. While we're here. 30? Was golems never done? I got 32 gold for that. Hello? That felt terrible. Twisted Fate already used ulti, so I should be able to get this and just walk it out. You too. We have stairs gauge now, very important stuff. Making sure I'm running away, yeah. It's very easy for him to just follow up on me there. Alright, reset. Stairs gauge has been bought. I still have stopwatch, very important to note. And we're looking pretty good. One, and I don't have enough space for control ward. So after this stopwatch purchase, I guess I'm going for a Kempunk Chainsword or a Death's Dance. 3D champions, though this guy's doing AP, so it doesn't matter too much. But also what matters is... Camp Punk Chaser will be reducing a lot of healing from... I guess Varys doesn't have any, but this guy... I guess he's the only person, and he's not really a threat. He just ulted, I like that. Nara's mega. Mmm... And they're just running away. Um, uh, interesting. Twisted Fate topside. Oh, Twisted Fate ulted himself, and now they have vision of us. Ah, makes sense. Drop word over here. Um, Udir, hope you're chilling, dude. <laughs> we have supers coming in from mid lane. I have TP coming up. There's a ward over here. Ooh. <laughs> Chain CC, baby. You love it. Uh, don't get hit by that. We can. Nah, never mind. We don't dive here. We let Udir do his thing. I mean, we can dive, but it's very hard to. Ouch. That hurts. I'd love to lifesteal, but it's not going to happen. Mm. They're all down here, and Udyr's putting topside. This is really good. Not sh I I'm pretty sure Graves is somewhere in the back, just chilling. Nice. Stuff, please hit this. Valkaz has Zanyas, and Rel's like 2 HP under... Sadly, she's 2 HP. Oh, nice cleanse, dude. Man, you guys are something else, though. They get hit by everything. It's really unfortunate. And then she just randomly ulted. Twisted Fate should ult, but he won't. This Valkaz. <laughs> oh my god, I'm nasty with that one, though. Jesus Christ. Don't die! My E! My E was so good! I juked the Velkos key with that one! Run, Jin, run! Actually, I can fight with you here. Believe it or not. Hehehe, <laughs> Gazanyas. To be fair, I did not mean to press Zanyas. I meant to press Ignite, but my mind was just not in the right place. Um... Nice! Auto Q2. That's a thousand true damage. No! Child Spite's broken! Alright, whatever. Yeah, I did not mean to stopwatch right there, there. My mind was telling me to ignite, but I also wanted to stopwatch when my shield fell off, which is not when it fell off. 
So that was just really unfortunate. I, I, I truly wasted stopwatch there. If I didn't waste stopwatch, we could have uh, we could have gotten inhib turret here. Well, inhib itself, but yeah, my bad. Jin should be full build now, so he's absolutely very strong. It is a 36 minute game, which I honestly did not expect. And I've caught up in our farm, which is actually pretty cool stuff. So we are going to sell stopwatch, because like I said, I can't do anything else at this point. Honestly, getting MR would be huge. I've, I've always... Literally, AD is not the issue that's been killing me. Besides, I have quite a bit of armor anyway, so I guess Spirit Visage will help out tremendously. So I will just buy the MR component. Or I could go for 33% CDR. It's not really worth it. I'll do this. Um, good stuff. Nice, huge pick. Um, I'm ready to TP if he goes in. Where? Over there. Nice. I don't have to TP then. Um, nice. I'm TPing in. That's huge. Hit him. Nice. Good job. His bro. How unlucky is that? His Mountain Drake shield came back up in time, bro. That's absolutely insane. Oh my god. But alas, it does not matter. We finally end the game there. And I believe as I was fighting, my GA came up. You bitch! Alright, I didn't die. Nice. Yeah. What a... What a game. Sorry that I was on Silas's dick 24-7. To be fair, I, I had a little bit of reason to he was kind of insane <laughs> in a good and bad way he made some pretty sick plays but he also got caught 24 7 when he just simply didn't need to what i give it to i give it to uder i guess uder is literally just like the guy who gave me the world right um oh i forgot the chain scenes i'll do that now they got damage and not bad that's it there's really not much more to say i mean if the guy didn't dive like a lot later phase the game would have been a lot easier or if he didn't get pick on the sides but he did make good plays i will say that i will give him that anyways did you play like button comment and subscribe to see you guys in the next one bye bye good stuff good stuff